I'm Terry Bassard from the Empowerment 101 community. Are you ready to nourish and to cultivate? Today I want to talk to you about my simple approach to improving your self-esteem. And it starts with, stop the negative thinking ladies. We all do that now and then. I don't want you to focus on your shortcomings. I want you to focus on your positive aspects. You have wonderful attributes. You are a wonderful, awesome, amazing woman. Let's start thinking that. You have heard the terminology, you are what you think. Positive thinking, ladies. Now, I want you to aim for your accomplishments. I don't want you to aim for perfection. None of us are going to be perfect or will ever be perfect. How many of us make mistakes? I know I do. Every one of us does. But guess what? <laughs> it's a learning opportunity. Accept it. Give gratitude for it. You know, part of learning is how we develop. We will all excel at something, or some of us will excel at many things. Just keep on working towards it. When we try new things, let's say sports, maybe doing videos like this, you know, singing, it makes us feel awesome. When we start out, we're never going to be the best, but if we keep on working towards it, we will feel fantastic once we get to accomplish that, those things. You know, let's recognize what we can and cannot change. Some things we can change about us. We can change our attitude. We can change how we approach people. We can change how we are approachable. We can change our character. We can change our smile. How do you want people to perceive you? I want to be perceived as friendly, approachable, giving. There's certain things I can't change about me, and you know what? I leave that up to him. And those things, I pray about. We all have things that we can and cannot change. So let go of the things, surrender to the things that you cannot change. It's okay. You know, take pride in your opinion. Do not be afraid of your own voice. To own your own voice is to own your own true power. Ellie Drake says that all the time, and I love that. You know, setting goals, when we set a goal and we accomplish that goal, doesn't that feel great? Doesn't that just raise our self-esteem? You know, sometimes in the world, we can make a difference by helping others, Donating your time, making a small contribution, that always helps our self-esteem. It almost empowers us to help others. Exercise. I know that helps my self-esteem. How about laughter? Having fun, laughing. It just makes us feel better. It raises our vibration. You know, high self-esteem really plays a role in everything that we do today. You know, we do better at school. It's just a lot simpler to make friends. We do better with relationships. You know, um, we're just happier people. So let's all try to work on our self-esteem. I hope these tips have been helpful. Cheers. Here is to your inner power.